Uh, welcome back to the Untitled Show. We have PJ with us today, our resident Twisted Wonderland. Uh, what are they called? Expert? Uh, well, if you want to call me that, I'll definitely accept the title. Informer? I, I, I don't know what he is. Let me see. We got. We don't have too much news, but actually, it's good that PJ's here. Uh, uh, actually, <laughs> like a story that might might help to have their perspective but uh before we do that we'll get we'll ask how your weeks went uh start with pj since you're the my week yeah okay. how's your week been um it's been it's been all right it's been pretty good um i'm like forgetting everything that's happened this week <laughs> we can oh, back if you want. no 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 that's what i, I remember it I went to the ER. Uh, what so, the fuck? Oh, okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a good week. Um, but it was fine. It was nothing too dramatic. I went into this space time machine. It was it was a CAT scan machine. Um, but I'm all good now. So it's nothing too dramatic. I just went to the ER. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I just almost died. <laughs> This week, week was better than it was better than last week. I'll say that much. Holy shit, that's a rough ass life. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, oh. I'm feeling now, so. Okay, okay. Uh, you know our events or our weeks are uh, a lot less eventful, I believe. Right? <laughs> uh, what about your week? Well, hopefully, uh, I don't know. Do you go to the ER? And no, but I said step in cat puke twice. <laughs> oh, lovely. Oh no. <laughs> Was it the same cat both times? Yes, it was Ringo both oh. times. Ringo, oh my god. Because he doesn't show up his food properly, so he throws it back up. Um, the oh. first, both times it was dark, and it was in different rooms, and it sucked. No. Um, it's like legit changed my perspective of cats. Like, I used to think they were like <laughs> superior intellectual beings. No. But- no. But Ringo can't even oh. eat food at a proper pace, and I'm like, I, yeah, I, no, he just gorfs down food and fucks yeah. himself up. I definitely doubt his uh, intelligence. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, I honestly can't think of anything else aside from just having shitty gotcha luck. Oh, like oh, in Ark Knights, I did 180 pulls for Alt Aya. Um, I did a bunch of pulls for Nahida and Genshin. I managed to get Medicine Pocket in Verse 1999, so I'm happy. Yeah, okay. who'd you get for your 50 50? Uh, in Genshin Deha. Nice. I'm probably saying her name wrong, but. <laughs> uh, that's unfortunate. Um, what about your week, Gabs? How's your week been? <laughs> I've been off work all week because Zelda went and had a surgery on Monday. So I've been on full time nurse duty with Zelda. So it's just been chilling most of the week and i have persona 3 reloaded now downloaded and ready and once we're finished with the show it will be open to play and i can play it sweet we were gonna cover a bit of it that's why i was I <laughs> hoping to get uh pj's perspective on this one bit oh my god yeah yeah I'll, okay it's uh okay. i don't know you have special insight so maybe uh we'll see um I but... oh i don't yeah, know that is i don't know but it's yeah. quite the same, but it's, it's like it's on the same wavelength, I guess. Sure, <laughs> okay. I am. I am straight up oblivious to like ninety nine percent of things because I. Okay, I didn't even know Yuri on Ice was like gay. I was like, man, they're fucking chilling these homies. It's about something transgender, PJ, and I'm not sure if that's oh. completely the same as non-binary, but I you know, did. it's on the same wavelength. <laughs> I mean, I consider it the same way like non-binary is under the transgender umbrella yeah that's fair that's what i mean why is it only me that like... gets to have insight on it uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah yeah i guess we all have well you guys definitely have more insight than me because i'm like, sitting there i'm like oh interesting interesting all right uh okay let's we'll just start with some quick stuff let me see all right we'll just start with some super quick news uh let's see if we can oh it's not even showing ah uh, there we go <gasps> my voice again yeah yeah anyways we, we touched on this last week we talking about if people like were were offended with a uh, new game plus being 
you have to buy the deluxe for the new game plus. I think it was like fifteen dollars extra or something, something along those lines. Mm. Yeah, and not a big deal. Apparently, this game launched to their. It's pretty much like it has a chart down here. Uh, th right here might be kind of smallish, but yeah, it's pretty much like their most successful game yet. So oh, yeah, Lord. I guess that's all the update. Just uh, people were not. Uh, Look at all those really good games. Literally, all those games are good, man. Oh yeah, you weren't here, PJ, but Gabs likes the game because this game's like a Yakuza game. You usually go around beating people. Yeah, I love. I, I fucking I love the, like, the, the art style that I saw. I was like, that's definitely a Yakuza game. Yeah. Uh, but guess what? Gabs' favorite part about a Yakuza game is. <laughs> Boy. You... Well, it depends what you mean. Like, I my favorite part is Majima. But my favorite like game thing was going to Majima's like sunshine lounge and <laughs> playing with the girls doing the host club. <laughs> okay, word. Yeah, she, so she plays this Yakuza game not to beat up people, but to run her own cafe. <laughs> and also to see Majima. All right. Word. No, also, I'm mean... surprised. I thought like you play Yakuza games to beat people up, but all right. Still cool. Um, I I think making in the cafe, and, yeah, because it was perfectly valid. <laughs> that's pretty you cool. You want like RPG style, so it's like turn based, and that's more my thing. Oh, is this like a more action? -based? I think yeah, because I like a dragon was like turn based, but I oh. don't know for sure. I haven't played it. Interesting. Okay. Ah, uh, yeah, that was quick news. People not output and it's other thing. We see. We're just getting the quick stuff before we get into the longer stuff. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I just saw this headline and I'm like, hmm, I wonder if this could have what like does potential. That mean? I just want to look it Yeah, so it says if Sony okay. wants to track. Why would you believe that? <laughs> you don't want to ask those paint? questions. Like... Wait, 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 scroll back up. Go okay. back up. Oh, wait, wait for the information. I'm trying to do this thing called reading that. Okay, yeah, screw the reading. All the way back up. All the way back up. All the way back up. Oh okay. my god. Um, Pulse sensing in the invention capable of determining changes in players' mental states. Mental states. Well, that's not possible. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't know that. I don't know that your pulse really says anything about. It says a little bit about your mental state, but not enough. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, we're gonna go scroll down to this uh, patent they have here. That's like just... all right. The picture. This. All right. Yeah. That's what. I'm so, dude, fuck the words, man. Just go with the pictures. What the this fuck guy looks ecstatic. <laughs> PS5 controller capable of tracking. Perspiration, is that what that says? Uh, yeah, it says that. Uh, heart rate previously changes. filed a patent. Oh, up here, oh, you're reading the words. I'm looking at the picture. Yeah, I'm words, reading yes. that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Some of us can do that. You know what? Uh, before they have this other technology, it's like a webcam and it tracks your eye movement. And then they have like streams yeah. where like people like. Yeah, yeah. My partner just turned over their shoulder and was like, damn, you can read to me. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, you be sh sh oh man. I am unloved. Oh, <laughs> uh, but yeah, I, I think this is pretty cool. Like I would. I don't know what it's. I'm looking at this picture and I do not understand. I yeah, I, I, no. I I don't know. Maybe they get data. Let me see the raw data array. Maybe that's uh, it's reading your face, seeing if you're sweating. Mm -hmm. Maybe I, I I'm guessing. But it wants to detect shit in your hands, not your face. Yeah, 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 but maybe the, the you're controller. holding the controller. That gives you the pulse data. I, I don't know. Yeah. It's about the pulse data. I just don't... I don't understand this, how, this yeah, I don't know chart how this, that I'm looking at. I don't know how this picture actually makes sense. But I just like this guy's face. He's sweating balls. <laughs> His sweating. hands are sweating. For some reason. The will be able to differentiate between pulse and changes in breathing. Oh, man. <laughs> you know when you're fighting it's the boss, gonna... you're like... Panting? I oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think I've ever been panting while <laughs> fighting a boss. Yeah, no. <laughs> oh, oh, okay, you guys fight bosses different than me. Okay, well, that's fine. That's fine. They're trying uh, to make a horror game where you're like not allowed to get scared. Have you seen those like horror games where like they track like your your mic so like you can't yeah, yeah. speak loud? Oh, if you scream, it's like, it's it's the like game that, resets or like, whatever. What the fuck? Dude, I never knew that. The amount really? of times I've seen that. The amount of times I've seen videos of people playing games like that where they just unplug their mics. <laughs> Valid. Oh, like, yeah. my... Um, the only media I've seen is, like, where people use the eye tracker and they, and they put up, like, content where there's, like, 
heavy cleavage and they can't look at it. Like, that's the only content I've oh, seen. Yeah. Yeah. Do you remember that one video where that guy was, like, going this huge monologue before he started using that eye tracker and he was like i'm doing this for all the men i will never look I'm yeah through this whole thing i will not look at a single bird <laughs> and then he just sits in his chair and immediately looks <laughs> dude it's like it's so hard like i try to it's just like god damn difficult <laughs> That's some end game it's like such, it's such a good video. He just immediately looks at the booth and just goes Fuck, Fucking failed. <laughs> uh, let me see, that's all we got here. I, do, you, do you guys want games to be this immersive? No. 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 <laughs> it's too much. Yeah, I don't think this is. I feel AR... like they'd also find out like weird things about their players. <laughs> I think this is more so a thing so that they can figure out in some weird way what sort of moments in the game people like so that they can make that in more games dude know? i'm gonna yeah, yeah. Sort of thing. if i knew my controller was like tracking my how sweaty my palms were dude i'd be always wiping <laughs> my palms be like no nah, no nah, the game's not yeah, gonna I feel know like that made me insecure yeah. <laughs> yeah you play a game with like a fucking uh those ballroom masks so it doesn't like track a lot of your face you, you wear like i don't know Fucking, this is too much. Too much. Okay, uh, we'll get into this persona thing. I just want to, okay. Uh, yeah, we'll click on this. Yeah, anyways, we'll just go down here. Let me see. What was the title? Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we just, okay, okay. Let me see if we can make this bigger. Oh. An infamously transphobic line of oh, this has, this has spoilers. I haven't played this game yet. Uh, uh, sm small spoilers, like what well, was like, transphobia spoilers? Okay, okay, wait. Uh, so it's, I'll give you a TLDR because I kind of watched this a bit, but they just instead of making this person, making them transphobic towards the person, they just made the person crazy. So then okay, they're not yeah. transphobic now; they're just like this woman's crazy, and that's that's how they act. And then I was wondering. Are you guys okay with changing dialogue to suit like the times, like updating games, I guess? Like changing, I, I guess, the original. It depends how much they're changing. Yeah. This seems like just like a random like NPC like dialogue. It's, yeah, it's, I don't it's know. just a little. It doesn't really matter thing. that much. Yeah, yeah, definitely not part of the plot. Like, there's no way. Uh, let me see. And then this is the if one. It was, if it was like changing those two sailor scouts to be cousins, then you know <laughs> that, that yeah. makes no sense. They're, they're like main characters. <laughs> but it just, it just made it worse. It's like now I'm sleeping with my cousin, and he was also a girl. <laughs> That's cool. uh, I, honestly, just having that makes me want to watch the whole Sailor Moon thing. I just want to know, like, is who it? thought it was a good idea. I just want to watch it a whole, so I have all the contacts and all that type of stuff. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, I'm actually like kind of okay with them updating it. So yeah, I was like, because before, yeah, before I was like, huh, oh, they're changing it. But I was like, uh, they could tech games are always changing. Like they always yeah, get updated, yeah. and then like bug fixes, spelling mistakes, and so. On. And this is like definitely like random NPC, so it's not a big deal. Doesn't impact. I can impact. tell you that there are some people very bought her on the um community board for the game on steam there is there is there's like one person that's been posting many threads being like what's with this work culture why are they changing our game okay, why are they okay. censoring oh, okay so <laughs> i'm good so i i went i i I'll click on this video this is the original okay from the how the scene plays out so i wanted to wanted the more context of how it plays out whatever but then i read the comments so I was like, huh, are there people like this? And that there are some there are some people like this, but there's not many upvotes, so I'm thinking this is like well, kind of one off. But I, I'm pretty sure the majority of people are okay with them changing this stuff. I see the removal I have of this a scene. feeling I have a feeling that it probably I haven't seen it, so I don't know. Okay. You're okay I with I don't know you're what okay the with this comments are. Okay, you're okay with you, you guys want to watch how it plays out in the original? Like, this isn't the real, the new one. Do we gotta watch the entire sure. six minute video? No, no, no. This is okay. two different versions. It's only like a three minute clip. 
Okay, I don't know if you guys are interested in watching how I actually play though, but it, I don't know. I have a feeling that it's not going to be as bad as they're making it out to be. Uh, okay, okay. And that it wouldn't have mattered either way. But I don't care regardless. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Yeah, even when you watch it, I'm like, okay. But, uh, yeah, we'll just watch this. Hopefully I don't get hit for the copyright. Hopefully. <laughs> yeah, I also noticed people read at rapid speed. <laughs> this is That's not for me. <laughs> Come on, you guys are fucking... You guys this are is much. not... This is, this is actually, like, I'm fine. Like, I don't know who these three characters are, but this is a... Just going around random beaches, picking up, like, hitting on people, I don't know. <laughs> soundtrack what the fuck is this music? I'm this is what you're gonna be listening to, Gabs. I'm pretty sure this is the in-game music. I can switch it to Persona 4 music, I've got that option. Comfortable. <laughs> I like that one. I can't handle the three of you. I actually like that. That's funny. Is this just one to say I have no idea what the whole persona is about? Uh, it depends on the game, but it's usually similar storyline. It's just usually a bunch of teenagers rebelling against things that shouldn't be happening. Another question mark? I'm dead. Man, I use that Teehee all the time too. I'm dead. But yeah, that's the that's the whole scene. The, the question mark after the realization was crazy. Are they putting beautiful weight? Oh, let's see. Uh, I don't know. But yeah, uh, like it, I don't know. I, if I saw that scene while I was playing the game, I skimmed through a lot of stuff. I wouldn't even have noticed it. I don't know. You guys have any opinions on like the original? Honestly, a lot of Atlas stuff is just yikes. So, oh I'm really? Not surprised. Like I said before, oh, they they had a bi character in Persona Four and completely erased it. Apparently, they had an iffy scene in Persona Five. They were incredibly transphobic to one of their characters in Catherine. You know, shit like that. Mm, so it's kind of I mean, it's, it's, as, it's not it's not great, but I've seen yeah. worse. Exactly yeah. that. Like I like the interaction. She's like, I can't handle three of you. I was like, damn. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but I don't know. Are these you're about to play it, Gabs? You'll see what the new one looks like. But I guess she's she's just a crazy lady in the new one. I think she turned her into uh, so see. different. This is a completely different character. No, this is the character. Yeah. But, but that's what I'm saying. Like, it looks like a completely different character. Yeah, yeah. If I read this, yeah. I don't know. I was just wondering, like, I kind of feel bad for, like, flat earthers and stuff like that. Because these people, like, like if I saw them on the beach or whatever, you'd be like, oh, that person's crazy, whatever. The, but they believe that Earth is flat, okay? So, like, in their world, 
it's all good. But you, you make them feel bad. Well, try not to make them feel bad, but... I'm dead. <laughs> oh, no, it's like... <laughs> I don't know. That, that always has some interesting perspectives on this show. Oh, uh, yeah. The, anyway, that's what I was thinking about. That. I was like, oh man. It's... Anyways, don't hit on like random people at the beach. She seems kind of weird. Well, but at the same time, she was being like quite, quite strong about these boys that I'm guessing, judging by every other Persona game, are teenagers. <laughs> so yeah. I was also like, yeah. oh. Okay. Okay. Well, she, she's a, she looks like a grown woman here, I guess. I didn't even think about that. Okay, yeah, we're, we're done with this. That's pretty much all. Uh, okay. Yeah, we're not much. Okay, we're going to go into Twisted stuff. Oh, uh, boy. Uh, We'll start with this other image first from Twisted. We're going to actual details. Uh, Maybe you can give us like... Okay, Crowley. All right. So, all yeah, right. basically, uh, yeah, February schedule got released in both uh ian and jp and uh, everybody lost their shit when they found out in jp that the head mage of the school crowley was getting a card probably mostly because he's one of the only like legal characters in twisted world oh my god <laughs> wait, wait, what's that, what's that even mean like of age like, like, not underage yeah uh, yeah of age so basically the, the crowd is going wild, is basically what I'm saying. My thing is that in the Twisted Wonderland lessons, which is like little sequence you go into to upgrade your cards, it's like when you put the card in and they show up as a little TV, like at a desk or like in like a flight lesson, whatever. Um, and Sometimes, like, intermittently, they have, like, a chibi of Crowley come in, and you, like, trigger, like, a special lesson sequence. So I'm wondering if, like, there's just gonna be two Crowleys on the screen if you try to upgrade this door, <laughs> or if he's gonna get up out of his seat and stand in front of the room for oh his lesson. God. I would imagine you That's getting two I'm of them. But, yeah. Because... Hmm. Maybe someone else comes in and does it. Oh. But who? The, the real question is who? Yeah, I don't know who, but maybe someone else will. <laughs> I think the cane says something. What's that say? It says Raven. It's, just, it's just really cool. Oh, okay. It's Raven on it. He got his, like, fucking uh, keyboard looking ass <laughs> staff with him. <laughs> <laughs> that as well. I was like, damn, Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> like, it looks know, cool. Think... His key is so goofy. They're, they're like Night Raven College, which are the head mage of this school wield, and it's a key that says Fucking Raven on it. That's the lock. Just it's seems... also like not. We don't really know what the key opens. It's just he just got a big ass key on him. It's open something. <laughs> I don't know that it would actually open anything if it if it's just designed to say Raven on it. I don't know that there are any locks that are like. But this hey. is the Raven lock. Well, also, it's Disney they... logic. Yeah, they live in Magic Land. <laughs> true, yeah. true. But yeah, his card is really cool, honestly. I really love the composition of this card. Um, I really hope they don't fuck up the Groovy, because they've been doing that recently, unfortunately. <laughs> so, how does one fuck up, like, the Groovy? Like, what what, what makes it... So, it's like... Like, just ugly like any Yeah, it's like when uh. you, like, like, ascend a card and, like, unlock a new art of it. That's what, what the Groovies are in Twisted Wonderland, and basically, they've like recently just- The Groovies have been really, really horrible for no reason. Like, either it's like whitewashed horrible, or like the art itself, it like, looks really bad for some reason. So, like, yes. I, I just want- Yeah, because he has such a good base card, I just really want the Groovy to be pretty too. Yeah, I'm just thinking, like, a lot of games, when you, they have them in their initial state, they're not full form yet. So I guess it would be like him in his regular clothes going to Costco or something without his mask. And then when you, when you groovy him, then he gets the, the crow mask or whatever. Like, But here, you, if the base card is this final form, like I don't, I'm not sure where you go from there. I don't know. The groovies, like, it, it's really like, sometimes I get like a badass base card and the groovy is just like them like, a, like an image of them living their life or something like that because oh, the groovies are because they the go groovies with, like, going to Costco I think, yeah, that's what it is. Yeah, honestly because 
like they come with like personal stories and the groovy art is usually reflective of like what happens in the story um so yeah so it might be curly going to costco or wearing his stupid ass oh my god his stupid ass hawaiian shirt i need to find this right oh no <laughs> yeah i'm just thinking like even in magical land people are like oh he's of age i'm like what isn't this magical land <laughs> oh I, hold on guys i found the image i wonder if it could oh be god. like being of what? age is important now what, what? What are the uh, what? Polish? Yeah, even in what? magical land. What oh my is god! It? <laughs> I love that. <laughs> oh my the god! Right. With the shirt and the pants. This is the outfit he's going to be wearing in the groovy. I'm telling you. I hope so. Dude, this this guy is the guy at the Costco. I swear to fucking god. He's gonna he's gonna, <laughs> he's gonna be on the beach with that lady. <laughs> I'm dead. This guy is the guy Look. buying like. Fucking ten pounds of frosted flakes, like thirty eight wings. I like, how, I like how he like changed into this Hawaiian shirt, but he kept those claws. He was like, I'm keeping the claw. Yeah, the mask and like the, the big scary claws. Yeah, this looks like <laughs> I don't know, like fan art. Like in, in the terms of like <laughs> not dead. like the quality, but in terms of like it's so out like out there. Let's yeah, go. I was yeah, I was surprised by the, the like the simps, honestly, because they kind of just like emerged out of the depth of the Twisted Wonderland fandom, I guess. Yeah, that surprises me too. Because like, what if what if he takes his mask off, like, wh and it's not what you want, guys? <laughs> I'm dead. I think that's part of the appeal, honestly. They a mystery man. Movies, I get it. Yeah. I get it. Yeah, but he's not like that good of a guy, honestly. Like during this sequence, he's like, all right. I'm going on vacation during winter break. Here's my number if you want to reach me. And like the main character like tries to call him multiple times for help, but he doesn't pick up. <laughs> oh, this guy's he a just... boss. <laughs> so everybody, so, so what I'm getting is that all the people that are simping are just like, I can fix him. <laughs> yes, <laughs> they don't even want to fix him. They just want to want that. Yeah, they want their like. <laughs> Old, so, old man, bird. what is what they want, uh, Val? What do they want? They want the hands? Or do they nah. want, or the, oh my god. <laughs> what do when Val said that, I was like, yeah. when Val said that, I was like, I could ask, but I'm gonna <laughs> let that slide for Val's sake. And then Nat came in. Oh, fuck. Okay. Yeah, I like this character. It's really cool. Yeah. It's weird that he's, he's the big boss, right? That he's the principal guy? Or... Yeah. The head okay. mage, as they call him. Interesting. Yeah. So yeah, I... he's kind of mysterious. He doesn't. He he seems to have lore behind him, but we don't really know anything yet. Yeah. Before you said that this was this person was like of age, I was just thinking like the whole school is run by like children, like Lord of the Flies type thing. And then there is no <laughs> well, adults. What I was thinking though as well, Nat, when you said that, because I'm like, so he, the, where are the other teachers? <laughs> Oh, they, 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 there's other teachers, and also Sam, who is, like, the shopkeeper. I love Sam. He's, like, my fave staff. But, um, they had, none of them have cards or anything like that. He's the first, like, staff member to get a card. Ah. Uh, or, yeah. it could be, like... Well, then maybe Sam will be there when you upgrade him. I really... I would love it if Sam were there. I love Sam. Should we Sam? Should we Sam jumps in? <laughs> I'm not oh uh, okay interesting uh we'll go to the road map i think that's what this is that's what i uh, listed as outline oh the, the schedule the schedule, the schedule oh, okay. is what it's called that <laughs> words that's, that's uh damn, that's a big picture <laughs> all right okay Let's i don't see. know what we can listen to you oh it's kind yeah. of something all right twisted yes, this, is, this is the english server version so yes, Peter's birthday, February 4th, I'm going to be logging in. Val, I have to in. make an account so that I can... <laughs> Don't you always... I'm for real. I'm assuming you're a daily player though, PJ, no? I am, yeah. I'm just saying, I'm especially going to be logging in for Katie's birthday because they give <laughs> you free, a free, like equivalent of like a free 10 poll on everybody's birthdays. What the fuck? No way. 
Yeah. They give you yeah, like well, music. They have, it makes sense. And though, you want to know have you, for it. Yeah. And you want to know something that Val doesn't log in every birthday. Even I tag, I I tag them every time. What kind of Honestly, what would be helpful is if you tagged in the morning and then later at night when I'm actually like on my laptop where I have Twist because I'm like okay. at work, I'm like, oh cool, somebody's birthday and then I forget and then it's oh. like the next day I'm like, shit, I should have walked into Twist in Wonderland. Good. We have I old you people brains, PJ. We have old people brains. You have to yeah. sort no, of that's real. work with what that. Can I, what <laughs> can I do grandma? specifically though? I'll be like, at Twist. It's someone's birthday, and then like at night, I'll be like, "Val, log in." <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Okay. That'd be in, so helpful. in a lot of games, you know what happens on their birthday? You get like three cents of, of not pull oh, currency. Yeah. You get three cents of like upgrade currency. Like yeah, in yeah, Reverse Ninety Nine, you get like three thousand Sharpadonti, which is like their money, but not their currency to pull. You get like nothing. But here, you get yeah. a ten pull. Holy fuck, yeah, but bro. You get a tempo because they have anywhere. a card. Mm -hmm. What? So you're saying, okay, when they release a banner, mm -hmm. that means they give you a, a tempo with that, that pull? Like that? No, because it's a birthday no, thing, no. so it's, it's well, special yeah. so that they, they give you the get a card and a... for it, and you can use it on any banner. So you what? could use it towards what? their birthday banner, what? or you, you can save it, it for a different banner. Yes, you can use it on any banner. Yeah. Imagine... You go to you show up to the buddy's birthday. It's like I know it's your birthday, but I fucking spent your money for this <laughs> other buddy. <laughs> yeah, every Twisted Wonderland character that isn't Bill, I log in for all their birthdays. I only pull for Bill. I know it's your special day, but thank you for the ten pull. I'm Holy spending shit. it on transgender. Oh, okay, <laughs> interesting. Dude, this game is like gives you stonks. Yeah. And that's, that's about to start playing Twisted Wonderland. Dude, that was just weird. No, I'm like, Matt would actually have to play because it doesn't have like this. Oh, well, yeah. Auto? Oh, it doesn't have no. effortless no, gameplay? It have no, it has no, the, like, no, the dancing ones. Yeah, oh, really? The game. With them. Yeah. I was going to say because Nat can't read and it's story based. Oh, Nat just skips story. Oh. And Nat's already said yeah. that he's going to play Ecoman Villains, which is completely story based. I, I, he's already I'm said good. he's going to play that and skip yep. it. Yeah, yeah. I'm just going to skip the story and just collect as many pistols as I can. And then. Just... Oh, <laughs> my yeah. God. Well, we're going to yeah, see how that goes. I can say Twist of Wonderland is not the best game for that because the actual gameplay in Twist is like horrible. Plus, I don't want to. I don't want to be grabbing no twisted uh, pistols. Okay, we're well, gonna stick with the Icky Man villains. Oh my god! Oh my god! All right, let, yeah, let's move on to the basketball club. <laughs> All right, basketball. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so basketball jersey cards will be lit. All right. Uh, mm, let me whatever. Do so yeah, they have they have club cards coming out. Basketball club already got fully released and so they're just basically putting all the basketball club cards in one banner and they're like you can pull for them and you'll get tokens from pulling wait so can you pull like use your tokens to buy the older ones older basketball I mean, well this says it can be exchanged for furniture so it sounds like you'll only be able to buy furniture with the tokens yeah that's what it's uh, saying that. which is not very the useful uh, okay Okay, you I'm gotta not... read that. Read the words. Read it yeah. to me. Yeah. And joint exam, everybody's least favorite event. You have to play Twisted Wonderland Battles to get your coins. And then you can, you can exchange those coins for resources. That's it. <laughs> That's the event. You battle and you get points. Oh, just so early points. How much time does like grinding an event take? every event for this um it really depends on which event joint exams tbh don't take that long it's really only gets grindy if you're trying to get a certain score which would give you more coins but, but okay so you're okay if you just get an average amount so then it's quick ish yeah you have 10 battles to do every day you can do them on auto if you really don't oh like so it. there is an auto yeah Oh, yeah, just not for the like rhythm game. Yeah, okay. rhythm game. Even well, after you complete it, with TBH Val, you can just not play the rhythm games. Like after you clear them the first time, and it'll count it as clear. 
Hmm. Some of them. Whoa, wait, wait. But you still have to do it the, the first time, right? Yeah, well, because usually they're in events and you have to, you know, pass them to... Uh, oh, yeah. oh, oh, hold on. So, I clear it the first time, I put in the brain power, and the second mm -hmm. time, I don't press nothing. And then I just let the stage run and it still counts as a clear. Yeah, for like a good amount of them, yeah. I don't think some a lot of the main story ones don't work that way. You have to like clear like a Actually like maybe I'm wrong. Maybe that's just the that's just the cutscenes. Hmm. Interesting. Right, okay, okay. Oh so, yeah. I don't know why I think if I this look... joint exam is like old man stuff. Like you go to the doctor, they check your joints. Cool. Oh yep. Yeah. Your Curly knee joints, sir. Man, they got so. the hammer out. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, it's just because you're doing course, every single type way, of Homer. exam. <laughs> uh, let's see. What's coming in February? Oh my god, the culinary crucible pepper pandemonium! Show us the second card that's in the... the oh, yeah. Oh, no, no, that, that's too far. That's too far, Not You're going too far. <laughs> okay. <sighs> so, another cooking event. Okay, cooking events I actually enjoy. Because they're pretty chill. You just you send them off on excursions and they collect all the, the ingredients for you and then you you just combine them, you cook them up and you get their cards. Pretty chill. Okay, you send them out every that. four hours, six hours, eight hours? You can decide. It, I think the lowest amount of time you can send them out for is 20 minutes and the longest is six hours. Okay, so you check back every six hours. Obviously, the longer you send them out, the higher chance to get to get stocks. good ingredients. Oh, okay. To get good ingredients, yeah. And yep. then once you get the stuff to buy the card, do you have to keep going, or are you good? You're good. Well, like you have a meter to like for all the tokens you earn, and once you complete the meter, like you're basically done with the event. But you can grind more to get more tokens and get more stuff from the shop. That's it. It's pretty okay, cool. Okay, so how how do you is clearing the shop like is it within reason like can the average person if they play a lot can they clear the whole shop for some events yes for the cooking event i think it's harder just because well maybe not mm. or just because like you have a set amount of time to complete the event and you have to yeah everything takes so long and in bursts yeah and you can only earn tokens from cooking so okay so how I'm just wondering, well, like the kind of obviously I don't play Twisted, but with this cooking event, since it's like semi chill, I'm assuming this stacks with another event where it's like not as chill. No, it's just a cooking event. This game seems so weird. Like it somehow respects <laughs> part of your time. Like you know, a lot of gadgets they don't give a shit about your time. They'll just waste all your time every day. <laughs> they won't give you no pulls. Holy yeah. shit. This Matt, can you believe Twisted Wonderland doesn't have daily wishes? We have weeklies. I think uh, you mentioned that, and like it blows yeah. my mind. Like it almost like you said you log in every day. I just actually assume yeah. you're supposed to log in every day. Like that's just a mandatory thing. Mm -hmm. It's very weird. You don't. Yeah, I don't. I'm I, not I, mandatory, Matt. Just so you know. Yeah, bro. bro you know, like it <laughs> just do that. Like, it took me, like, five, like, I'm with Mishy, it took me, like, five years for her to explain to me she plays games for fun. Like, actually, I don't, even know, I, I don't even know what she's talking about. She's like, I play games for fun, and then I stop them when I don't find the fun. I was like, what? What are you talking about? <laughs> you can't play games for fun. <laughs> you play games for stress or something? Bro, it's like a, it's a job. It's like, I, I, I come home from my Yeah, he money plays job. Lost Ark as much as, like, a full-time job. Yeah, see? So, after I'm done my, like, yeah. money job, real-life job, I come home, I do my other job. Like, I do my farming games, collect my berries, collect this. Like, I have a routine, okay? It's, it's, All right. Yeah, and so, for, to not log in daily, like, I don't understand. Tractors eject bonus token showcase. Oh my god, oh, I didn't even realize they're dropping, they're dropping the track club cards now, here. So, uh, we're gonna have another club card coming. Uh, let me, let me grab his, his little, cause he's, he's pretty cute. Oh, I like him. Hmm. Oh, god. I wonder, like, with their birthdays, they give you the ten pool, like, how many cards are in this game? Is it like, 
to the point where it's no no chance you could have them all is that how these like um with the, every student because it's the only student birthdays night grade from college students and i think it's like 26 something like that wait 26 students something like that around there oh, oh Gap, my god yo oh, gabs has to go oh, okay all right well goodbye gabs but um how many variations of every card like a rough way there's like over 10 like you you collect all uh, the bills cards how many bills cards are there i like just ssrs or all cards in general uh let's let's yeah ssrs yeah yeah the harder to obtain ones i would assume okay so i'm pretty sure they didn't release any other bill ssrs in jp yet so i'm pretty sure we're, we're at five Oh, if we count the birthday card, then JP has six, and um, what? oh, so has five. is there only one birthday card? So like, if JP they... is a year. It's a year ahead of us, but no, they release a different birthday card for them every year. So oh, okay, okay, okay. JP has one extra because they're a year ahead of us, and therefore have like one extra birthday card per character. Okay, but okay, let's say okay, we've got the birthday ones under wrap for the track one. I'm assuming there's a track bill. Um, no, not track, but they they're releasing club cards for every character. Um, they're all in different clubs. And Bills haven't hasn't been released yet, but he is in the film basically the film club. So yeah. Huh. Seems yeah, like if you only card. if you only have like five or yeah, five bill cards and you have them all, it seems like there's not too many if you wanna simp for one character. Uh, yeah. It's like I mean it seems pretty manageable, but then like they do this like they'll just like release like an SSR of your favorite character, like three months in a row and you're like i literally want to kill myself oh shit that happened with red for about one time there's no oh, red yeah. for like two months then it was like three reds in a row okay i see i see that's pretty smart of them in a, in a shady way <laughs> i'm dead yeah they're just like these sometimes like i like many characters not just you Oh no, no, I was just wondering if you wanted to yeah. like simplify your whatever. Obviously you need other cards as well to play the game, I would assume. Yes, definitely. Well, for me personally, I like having the meta cards so I can do uh -huh. battles. A meta think. enjoyer, all right. I know uh, Val's not a meta <laughs> enjoyer, neither is Gaps. So I'm the only meta enjoyer <laughs> here. At least I have a fellow yeah. Uh, yeah. meta enjoyer. I enjoy Twisted Wonderland meta. <laughs> no, well, obviously helps gets you more stonks, then you can get more stuff, so. Mm-hmm. Let me see, birthday bash promo. Oh, Azul, Azul's birthday. It's going to be on the 24th. Still so another, another ten pull for us. I still, the, um, this whole concept is so weird. You get ten pulls, like, and, Val, can you imagine, like, yeah. Genshin giving you ten pulls for their birthdays? Can you just oh imagine it? You're like, I can't even yeah, imagine. Genshin it. gives you, like, food. <laughs> I'm dead. Like, like, I'm dead. like a mediocre food item. <laughs> PJ, for their for their anniversary, their third year anniversary, they got three single pulls. Okay, baby. No, that was for the Chinese New Year. I don't remember what we got for our yeah. anniversary. I think yeah. we might have gotten like a single ten pull. <laughs> yeah, see, they were choked. They were like Oh, and a free pet. Ah, oh, so what's the pet do? Nothing. Okay. <laughs> this all year round. <laughs> Uh, yeah okay for, for twist anniversary in em this year we got um one ten pull that you can use on any banner but that's only if you logged in at least nine days well, nine it, days of the of the what of the of the anniversary period which hasn't ended yet it ends on the fourth um how long is it like a month uh i think it started on the 18 that maybe okay so you so you log in half the days and then you get the temple yeah that's that's pretty fair 
and um oh yeah and we also got for the anniversary three three ten pulls on the anniversary specific banner which is nice of them yeah so. that, that's nice i know sino gave you a free on the third anniversary three ten pulls I don't know for a week, two weeks, but you get nothing from them. I don't know. In Twisted, you actually get stuff. I got two SSRs from it. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe, maybe they yeah. maybe they make these simp games like to get you more stuff. What about Obey Me, Val? You get a lot of stuff in Obey Me. Lately, I haven't. Um, <laughs> <laughs> partially because my shit luck and because I haven't really been playing much. But um, I don't know. Obey Me's rates are pretty bad too. Mm. Yeah. yeah. My two SSRs were like a dupe and one new card. Okay, and how many for the the dupe only... system? Uh how many do you need? Like how like is it five dupes? Or to um, max the card or whatever? Yeah, it's um so you have to pull it five times to max it out. Yeah. Okay, that's pretty normal. And it's like negligent negligibly better every time or yeah they, like you have a stat raise but also you can um, max out the cards by um, using perfumes which you can get SSR perfumes in events um if you would grind for it they're usually pretty expensive but you can get them and you can max out cards that way too you don't have to pull for them the fuck man it's almost like they don't hate their player base this is looks so weird. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay. Maybe I just picked... have so, but since you mentioned Genshin earlier, I should mention the th the four star selector and the three um like pulling currency, that wasn't in global. Yeah, that's in CN. Yeah. yeah. For their CN. So universe. like we got nothing in global. <laughs> oh, so it's even worse. <laughs> yeah, it's even worse. <laughs> I see it's it's weird. I'm just I'm used to abuse and then you're like, oh then twisted they give us like ten pulls and <laughs> they don't hate us. You don't even have to log in every day and I'm like what 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 is going yeah. on here? You don't have to, but it helps. Because if you yeah, log yeah. in like every day, like every seven, like seven I think. Yeah. Like, you log in seven seven days in a row you get like it mm, it goes like five, fifteen, twenty, twenty five gems Five, so how many okay, that yeah, is yeah. like 60 something gems in total from logging in for one week so it does give you like some leniency so i like i like that like usually a lot of games they do like the 30-day calendar event and then if you log in uh, the best rewards at like the 23 day that's if the game doesn't hate you if the game hates you you have to log in all 30 days or you're you're like who you might as well uninstall the game yeah. yeah yeah i don't know it's uh hopefully more games take this approach like it i don't know how many players play twisted as well like... i think one of the only reasons that they're like kind of all right is because well it's aniplex and it's not like 100 percent disney um but like partly disney because what I know is that Aniplex gets all of the revenue made from Twists. They just have to pay Disney every year for their brand name, basically. Oh, their IP. Hmm, interesting. Yeah. But they don't have, like, I feel like it doesn't have too many Disney characters. Like, I saw, like, the, the Mickey Mouse on the JP side. I don't know if that came ever to the global, at least not yet. The Mickey Mouse card? Yeah, we, we that was in both. That was the only card that's ever been released in both BN and JP at the same time. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, but it yeah. doesn't but, seem like there's... No, yeah. Well, Sh there is. Because they have statues of, like, Disney characters in there, like... Oh! In their okay. main street. Okay, okay. Uh, and they're, like... They use little sequences of the mu the movies and the main story sometimes. It's, like, oh, okay. where, like, the main character has a dream about the Disney movie plot, basically. I can't tell that it's like more helpful for Disney. It's kind of like marketing advertisements in the game. <laughs> I mean, like, kind of, in a way. But, like, all the characters, like, they're not... I wouldn't, in my mind, they wouldn't be Disney characters. Like, all the students. 
students no, seem like it's like a whole different franchise but they also yeah. can borrow elements from disney so exactly yeah that's they're based off of characters but they're not the characters themselves yeah yeah i don't know it's pretty interesting i wonder hmm. yeah i haven't really played yeah. any of these uh i don't know what would this game what genre what, what genre of game is this i don't even know what they're called um i mean i don't know if you're thinking about otome but this twist is in an otome so it is otome so it, because I wasn't not. sure. It's not really like a dating sim, right? This one's like more no. of a just like the really? the story student story type thing, right? Yeah, the label it is like adventure RPG, um, visual novel. Oh uh, yeah, works? yeah. Yeah, I guess that would be uh, adventure RPG. Okay, okay. Whereas I see, like in my mind, oh. o- Obey Me is like straight up a dating sim, like yeah. You know, you... On on the Apple App Store, it's labeled as narrative adventure JRPG. Okay, narrative uh, that would make okay. Yeah, I don't I don't play any of those games. But we'll yeah. I'll pick. We can tell. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, even with the voice acting, once they start like talking, I'm like, oh, skip, skip. I don't got time for this. I gotta I gotta I gotta farm the van. Okay, we we got shit to do. We don't got time for this. But I'm ass- that? Uh, no, that's pretty much it for Twisted. I'm assuming, okay, how long has it been out for like two years? In English, like, yeah. You don't play JP as well, do you? No, I don't. Some people do both at once, but I would rather die. Oh, so you don't want to play two, like, even if you could, you wouldn't? Yeah. Okay, okay. Does this game occupy like a lot of your phone time? It occupies a lot of space. <laughs> like uh, gigabytes or like in your head? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Both. <laughs> yeah, that's why I moved it onto my blue stacks because I didn't play it enough. I'm like, yeah, I can't justify the- taking up this much phone space. Damn, I didn't know it took up so much because Val has uninstalled other games because it just took up too much space. Yeah. Yeah, it takes up a lot of space. Okay, like, I guess there's a lot have, of... It's not have Twisted Wonderland and Genshin Impact downloads it onto my phone. Wait, you play Genshin too? No, I don't. I'm okay, trying to I was like, I, I didn't take it. Yeah, I didn't take you for a Genshin player, PJ. <laughs> Do you play any other games, or is this, this your, like your main game? Um, my main game. Sometimes I log into Obey Me. Uh, sometimes I like to revisit Mystic Messenger. Dude, that game hasn't shut down yet? Holy shit. No. I think that, that was, was a OG, one of the OGs, so much, right? Yeah. It was 2016. Holy cow. Huh, you guys... You, you ever log into Mystic Messenger, Val? Because I'm pretty sure you played it before. Uh, it's been years, yeah. Okay. I only, I only ever open it once every blue moon huh okay interesting uh we'll we'll see how this whole world goes for me with no reading playing a reading game or narrative game with no reading i i've never we'll see how it goes maybe they'll have a fun like battle section rhythm section or what i don't know what they have in that game no i i played an ikman game before and they didn't really have anything like that mm. So you, I really don't know what you're gonna be playing. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Like, do, do your choices even like impact the story? You know what? I don't remember. I think so. Okay. Do they in twist, or do you more or less end up the same result? I don't know. Like your choices don't impact anything. Well, like they'll impact like a line or two of dialogue, and that's it. Yeah, I know. In Obey Me, you can just explore both options with like the. What of those features, right? You can just check them out, though. I think. Yeah. So I don't yeah, know. Yeah, your options don't really matter in that game. You can just fuck around to find out. Yeah. Well, I will find out what uh, not reading a reading game is. It's like not reading a book. <laughs> huh? There's no pictures in the book. 
<laughs> yeah, we'll see. Yeah, you just flip through it. You're like done. Closes the book, <laughs> set it down. We'll set it out. I don't know. I don't know. It took you guys so long. I killed it. <laughs> Effortless gameplay. Yeah. I don't know. I'm looking for kind of games to explore. That'll be a new one for me. So we'll give it a shot. Obviously, it won't be like a main game. That's what I think. That's what I start. I start all games like, ah, oh, I'll just Funny try it out. Funny one of your main games. Fuck, you never know, man. We'll, we'll see how it goes. Uh, that's cool that Twisted is treating their players right and that you enjoy it. That's good. Mm -hmm. yeah. I don't think we have anything else. This is a pretty short week-ish, I think. Oh shit, we'll Nothing, be... I think so. Alright. You have anything else that you'd want to... I don't know. Discuss, PJ? Bug? No, not really. I love you. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Uh, you want to lead us out, Val? Give us money. Okay, thanks. Bye.